Welcome to Trojan Boatworks. Today, Tom shows you how to install EVA decking. This show is brought to you by the motion picture Huntin' Bigfoot, starring Jamie Janik and Ben Utek. It's an action-packed adventure with the CIA, space aliens, hillbillies, a cable TV show, and a lady Bigfoot, all tangled up in the same web. Available now on YouTube and Amazon Prime. Huntin' Bigfoot, movie fun for the whole family. Hey, hey, here we are today back on Think Tank. Today, the, the EVA teak flooring is going in. First thing I'm doing is I'm laying in borders across my start point. So that's gonna be this bulkhead here. I come down to a 45 degree angle there, that lays in, and then I go across the bulkhead and enter to the galley. I'm not doing the center, the sides, because that's, we're gonna need a spillway. There's some moisture coming down there, and that was hence part of the problem. So I'm laying this out. It should go fairly quick, because they're pretty much full length rolls, and then I'll cut in a border at the bottom, wherever I wanna put it. But once again, you start with a straight edge, across here, I then made it this corner, and then I shot it with a laser line. One of the benefits of using lasers, you can also get your lines right on your deck lines, because there's a metal deck plate that goes on here. And as you can see, um, we're pretty spot on. So then after you get it down, you can hit it with a roller, but I don't have a roller. So I basically walk the floor, all the seams, all the edges, and I get them all good and tight. Okay, the first piece is down, and the end is cut off, leaving room for a border. It's right up against that edge, so I won't have to add anything there because the, uh, it'll come from the other piece, and then I'll just cut that off with the, at the edge of the, uh, the wood so that I can put in the border frames that are there. All right, off to the second piece, should lay right in. So here's one of those times when layout makes all the difference in the world. Remember all the time we spent laying out those lines down there to match up with these lines up here? Well, I just laid the first piece of steel in to go, or shall I say aluminum, to go around the hatch covers. And look at the lineup on the caulk lines on the cut point. Well, here we are to a close of Think Tank 2's first um, upgrade. We started with fixing the rear deck, had a soft spot right over here underneath that city. And we showed you the video of that one. And then we replaced the deck with an EVA deck, uh, foam deck. And then we put it over the area here in the engine rooms and it cuts in. And as I spin around, goes down into the galley area, salon. We've got it all through here. We put in a teak folding dinette table. It folds right up. Things go in and you've got a standard settee. And then turning around in the kitchen top or the galley, uh, we converted it to a serving station. These clients don't use um, the, you don't use any of the cooking facilities and such. So then I'm going to build a wine rack and go into here and then some netting across here and we'll paint the insides. And then I'm going to put some LED remote controlled lighting in there and underneath on the counter there and in here and in here. But uh, overall, we did the flooring in there as well. Um, overall, the project turned out very well, as you can see, and uh, the owners are quite happy with it. So on to the next. Well, that's it for another edition of Trojan Boat Works. I hope you liked the show. And remember, if you liked what you saw, like and subscribe.